keep it, you've updated for our next trip. We'll probably be met up Melbourne for matches. To Melbourne. <laughs> yes, I predicted correctly. After we changed this trip originally about eight times from what it started out, as we are going to Melbourne, so it does count as a correct yeah. prediction for me. Alright, we got to go, geez, and catch our train. We will film, we will update you when we're at our train. Bye. Later. Yeah. Yeah, we're here at Chatswood Station, train station, and we're waiting for our train. Possibly we're off to Melbourne, and we're going to do it in a day. I know it sounds far fetched, but it's possible. We are on the plane to Melbourne now. We will update you when we get on the Sky Bus in Melbourne. Thank you. Okay, we're here on the bus to Melbourne on the Sky Bus in the airport. And to talk about first impressions, just look at the weather. <laughs> I mean, I'd usually call this weather glorious, but I don't think I'd call it so-called glorious. Oh, well, yeah, and on the approach to Melbourne car, talk about, you want to go to Luna Park, you can talk, forget Luna Park, go get a flight through a thunderstorm. That's like turbulence to the max. It's like epically awesome. It's him having the time of our lives. Yeah, it's cold, windy, raining. And I just prefer if it's cloudy and a bit warmer. Actually, I do like this weather, I suppose. Yeah. And we'll update you when we get to the train on the train in Melbourne. Yeah, ladies Thank you. G. We're on the Route 75 train to Vermont South, and then we'll be catching a 732 bus to Knox City Shopping Centre. We we're a bit late getting into Melbourne, and as such, what we're about 20 minutes approximately to go to but we should have enough time to get back to the flight, back to Sydney. We will do the next update in the, in the bus to North City. Thank you. Right, we're here on the bus to North City shopping centre, and look, it's got sunny. Well, can a green tail? But just quickly, we see. It. Yeah. And, and we're 31 minutes late. Yeah, we're behind schedule, but hopefully we won't get stuck in Melbourne for the night. Hopefully. At Southern Cross. Bye. We're here. I'm um, back in Melbourne, Southern Cross Station. I'll tell you, it's like a palace compared to Sydney Centre Station. It makes you want Sydney Centre Station. It's a damn upgrade. I'm not joking. It looks so modern. Anyway, we're about to board the Sky Bus back to the airport because we obviously are going for just a day because it is a trip to a random place. Update you when we get to the airport. Thank you. Peace out, cheese. All right, we're here in the um, departure lounge at Tyler Marine Airport in Melbourne. We're in Terminal 4, and from the outside it looks like a tiny tin shanty roof shed. Um, inside it's actually pretty cosy and good though, but obviously Terminal 3 is a lot better. But we get stuck in this one, that's okay with us, obviously. Now we work, we've been working out during the day what, where we'll be if we took the train. Right now we will probably be arriving in Melbourne. Right now we're getting ready to leave Melbourne, so go figure. 
and and we'll update you when we're on the plane. Thank you. Okay, we're on the plane now, back flying back to Sydney in the pitch black night sky. So I get the pleasure of looking out the window at nothing. Apart from the plane wing and the, one of the engines and stars in the sky. Um, another night with Tim at Tim's house. <clears throat> so that means I won't get to see Manchester United play Chelsea at Old Trafford tomorrow morning in the Champions League unless I can get back to my house for 4.30 tomorrow morning, which is highly unlikely. So I was just saying I'm going to miss it, sadly. Um, <laughs> and we'll update you, so then, update you when you get back to see the airport. Uh, oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. We're here back in Sydney Airport, where we belong, and ironically, we came out of gate 54, we entered at gate 58, which is four gates back from it. Two gates back, one gate back, two gates back. So how ironic is that? Yeah, time and day. We will see you next at Central Station. Peace out, cheese. We're here back in Central Station, we have got platform 16. Update you when we get back to my house. On the plane back when... Oh. The food service was delayed by about 20 minutes, 25 minutes after we experienced some really heavy turbulence. So then we were halfway through our flight when we or when I ordered two hot soup. See, the remains of the pumpkin soup inside. Um, and I basically had half an hour to chug two boiling hot soups and, we and like I was taking it really casually and slowly until the, the, the captain said we had 25 minutes till landing when I started taking them off going you know, the first soup I was, all, I was only up to here in the first soup about here I was like ow, ow. and, then and eventually I did finish in time yes, and I'm like telling just to hurry up quick. thank god because we did like a huge lap of Sydney airport we went like all the way up we went all the way down to Wollongong before we turned around, pretty much. Yeah, I know, it's surprising. And then I thought more, there was that time before we reached Wollongong when looking down at the lights, I thought we were in Hornsby. <laughs> so I just thought the, the layout of the streets looked kind of similar until Tim, until I saw sea and then I saw big lights further down the coast. I was like, oh, we must be on the south coast. And then we turned around and got back in Sydney and we met Captain Stoner here. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Chester out, peace out, latest guys. And our next trip's perishing next year. Get ready for it. The only two delays we had, major delays we had on the Melbourne trip, was the Atrix failure at Sydney, which means we had to run to T2 at Sydney Airport, and the 20 minute weather delay in Melbourne on the way back to Sydney. From Melbourne, um, outside Tim's house, and uh, I think we're going to go knock on the door now. Let's go in, Tim. Hi. 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 Hi.